In this video, we're going to cover how to safely and properly load the cocked Raven crossbow. The Raven crossbow is designed to shoot only Raven branded arrows equipped with the new Orange Raven clip on knock. Point your cocked Raven crossbow in a safe direction when loading. Visually confirm the safety is in the safe position. The white dot is visible. If the safety is not engaged, push it to the safe position. Use only Raven branded arrows with the new orange clip-on knocks recommended for your Raven crossbow. If the knock is damaged, do not use the arrow until the knock is replaced with the new orange Raven clip-on knock. Visually inspect each arrow for damage prior to shooting each time. Look for damage to the knock and to the veins. Check for any splintering or cracking in the carbon shaft by flexing the arrow back and forth in your hand. Firing a damaged arrow can cause serious personal injury and damage to your crossbow. Make sure the knock and white fletching are properly oriented. Look down the length of the arrow with the white cock fletching pointed straight down. The knock opening should be horizontal and perpendicular with the white cock fletching. If the knock is not properly oriented, rotate the knock to the required position. Inspect the knock to make sure there's no chips or cracks. Never place any part of your body into the bowstring path. Always keep your hand forward of the string stops. There is never any reason for your hand to be in the bowstring path. Next, grasp your arrow directly behind the field tip or broadhead. The white color fletching must be positioned downward in the rail in the 6 o'clock position. Never position your hand in front of the arrow tip. Next, with your crossbow point in a safe direction, insert the knock end of the Raven branded arrow under the riser archway and into the center of the TTFS until it is fully engaged with the bowstring. It takes about five pounds of force to fully engage a Raven branded arrow with the bowstring, so push firmly. You should hear an audible click. If you are unsure whether the arrow is fully knocked, completely remove the knock from the TTFS and try again. Confirm the odd color fletching is in the down position. If the Raven clip on knock is not fully clipped to the string, the Raven crossbow will not fire. Center the forward end of the Raven branded arrow on the arrow rest at the front of the Raven crossbow. Your Raven crossbow is now fully loaded and is ready to fire. Sliding the safety to the fire position will allow the Raven crossbow to fire. If the Raven crossbow fails to fire, return the safety to the safe position. The white dot is visible. Point the bow in a safe direction and uncock the bow without removing the arrow. Once the bow is fully uncocked, remove the arrow and begin the cocking sequence again. Again, fully engage the Raven clip-on knock with the bowstring. Doing so requires five pounds of force. You should hear an audible click. Attempt to fire the Raven crossbow again. If the Raven crossbow still does not fire, return the safety to the safe position. Point the bow in a safe direction and uncock the bow without removing the arrow. Do not fire the bow further and contact the Raven customer service. In all other circumstances, Unloading the crossbow can be accomplished without uncocking the bow first. Point your Raven crossbow in a safe direction when unloading. Visually confirm that the safety is in the safe position. If the safety is not engaged, push it to the safe position. Never place any part of your body into the bowstring path. Always keep your hand forward of the string stops. Next, grasp your arrow directly behind the tip and pull the arrow forward until the Raven clip-on knock disengages from the bowstring and the arrow clears the archway bracket. Your Raven crossbow has now been unloaded and can be uncocked as explained in the video on cocking and uncocking your crossbow. 